hello everyone and welcome to my youtube channel if you have not yet subscribed please subscribe and i hope you guys are doing well so guys this video will be explaining how to insert a footnote using a laptop or a computer so guys as you can see i made a a, a screenshot uh by my laptop so just to show you guys uh how does it look like how does the web app look like when you're using a, a laptop so that it can be more easy for you guys to understand while looking at rather than to explain uh something that you're not uh, seeing so guys uh, as you can see i wrote how to insert a footnote using a pc so guys i'll be referencing this line yeah just to show you uh how to insert a footnote through this line yeah? let's assume that you have written your assignment or you have typed it or maybe uh you are still typing it yeah? so but you want to insert a footnote so guys check where this red dot move to ne? this red dot move to the upper line which is uh, near references so you select references and then after selecting references it's going to be like this so guys after pressing references it's going to give you uh, a menu as you can see it appears above the sentence um, here then you move here where the red dot is at eh? as you can see this is the, the subtitle is written footnotes so you go to a b to the power one as you can see it's written insert a footnote so you press this thing and then after pressing this thing it means that you are inserting a footnote so it's going to look like this so guys after pressing it automatically it's going to make this line for you now as i have explained uh, on the uh, previous video and then it's going to even write a smaller number for you uh, as i have explained now so this number represents the number of the line that you are uh, footnoting or maybe you are referencing via uh, this footnote ne? so since i have only one line in there it's going to write one if i had uh, maybe two lines or maybe i am putting a second uh, footnote it's going to write two if i'm putting the the third one is going to write three so here is the first one so that is why it's writing one so this one automatically it writes it for you so guys on that space you are being required to enter the reference of that number so as you can see here i just made it up as a number two so i just made it this up so it means that you are not going to make it up you're going to uh, reference according to the information that you got so yeah and then guys as i, I have explained ne, this is how it's going to look like ne? i try to zoom it out so that you can see how the page is going to look like uh, that smaller one that i told you about that was here here it is ne? so it's going to be like this if i have another sentence and then put a second uh, footnote below this one there will be two and then reference so this is how it's going to look like guys so footnote is not something that is difficult all you have to do just press references go straight to references and then go to a b to the power one insert a footnote and then making it like uh, inserting it using a laptop or a computer is far more easy than using a cell phone so a cell phone sometimes can be a little bit complicating uh yeah keep on subscribing guys and then share the link to those who uh, are still struggling with how to insert a footnote uh, for this one is for those who uh, are using computer a computer or a laptop and then if uh, you find someone who is using a cell phone you can refer them to the previous video and then if guys you do not understand something or some or a part or a certain part please comment uh, and then i do not mind to like i don't mind explaining it to you thank you for watching guys